Pay Collective, my video cut off, and I had only got... I had got to this number one is the only where I'd got to. And, and my husband called. So let me start over. I pulled this out. And this will be the the second part. I'll show you. Well, maybe not. I might not. Because I can still make this in the way it was supposed to say. But anyways, it says. Uh, oh, yeah. Please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. I welcome you for coming and viewing my channel. Uh. I'm Pam. Nice to meet you all. Thank you to my loyal support. I love you guys, and I hope that I can give you something today, okay? But some it says a farmer may be telling lies on you to other people in the community just for fun. Okay, well, I mean, it doesn't have to be a farmer. It can just be anybody. I, I wrote a farmer might be doing that because I made a little barn and, like, a little farm scenery collective, <laughs> And, you know, I'm sure farmers lie, lie just like any, everybody else has lied before. So, but this is pretty specific. And, uh, yeah, somebody's lying uh, just for fun. And then it says, uh, Julio Monsi is interpreting hysterical laughter. So, uh, what it's saying is, in a community, this person that's going around telling people in your community that you live in just for fun that, that you're crazy. And the people in your community has noticed that this man or woman that goes around telling lies on you, after when they're telling that lie, they will hysterically laugh after that. So people are noticing in your community that <laughs> that this person is, is fucking lying. They're, they're, they know it's a lie, because all they do, they they laugh. They, they think it's funny as hell. They love making fun of you for fun. But what they didn't know is scalemancy, and this is by the size, shape, and changing appearance of shadows of the dead. And nobody has permission to copy my cards. These names, and I'm saying nobody on this com in this community, I've never seen anybody talk about this, so nobody's going to steal this. Hell no. No, I'm a, I, I, I'll, I'll copyright. No, these are my cards. <laughs> Sorry, collective. I had to do it. But anyways, what it's saying about this person, this man that's going around lying, this farmer, uh, they think it's awful fucking funny that these you, you're somebody that actually has maybe saw shadows around you or you you might have lived in a house if there was dark shadows around but i think this this man's been uh going around lying and, and making a lot of people laugh at you by telling them that oh did you hear her talk about shadows of the dead people well what they didn't know is uh, my spirit team is funny as fuck because what's hilarious is they thought it was funny for, you know, to live is to suffer, to die is to be born again, and to end suffering. They they didn't understand that. Their eyes, the, my spirit team, and, and and other, even, they, they pissed off their own spirit team. The, these people don't realize, you know, your spirit team is people that's died. Your family, your, your genealogy, do you understand people that's died before? That's what your spirit... That's your spirit helpers, your spirit guides, okay? These people, what they didn't know is the the dead around them is going to make them suffer, and they're just going to sit and laugh at them for doing this woman like that. Oh, I love spirit. And look, they're, they're, they've been giving you the evil eye star. They've been making people in your community look at you like you was a crazy piece of shit. Like, look at that motherfucker over She's crazy. Blah, blah, blah. And I said, I feel like a jackass for making you hurt over what I said about you. Oh, now they want, now they feel bad. Now they feel bad, Collective. They feel like a jackass. But what they didn't know is, Collective, what they didn't know, see, I'm, I'm, a, I'm like this old jackass right here. I'd take my jackass leg and I'd go, hey, <laughs> And I'd punch him right in a pecker. I'd punch him right in a pecker. If I, if I, if I ever heard it out, so I say something about they been going around lying to me, I'd be like that, you, that jackass right there, and I'd let them see. I'd, I'd kick them right where it fucking hurts. Spirit's going to kick them right where it hurts. Now, y'all need to hit subscribe if you're new, because you know that was funny as fuck. And you know it's true. You know I'm telling the truth. 
So I love y'all and I appreciate you and I need your help getting around in a spiritual community. If you're new and you're a reader and, and you like how I do this, then you need to do this for me. You need you need to help me, okay, you guys? I love you and I appreciate you. Hang on, let me get a drink. I've been dusting and I can't breathe good. Let me go get my uh, nose spray. Hang on just a second. Okay, collective, I'm back. I had dust in my my ceilings and my ceiling fans. I can't breathe too good. It's that time of year. Oh, and then we got Nephilimontsy. This is studying the movement and shape of the clouds. They're a shapeshifter. They're a shapeshifter. They, they, they're shaping their energy around to make fun of you and your community and get people to fucking laugh at you. They're going around saying you're crazy because you, you, you sometimes get messages from your spirit guides and that they, they they're they're lying and telling people that you're suffering and i'm not suffering you know but the, all i think it's saying is the dead people uh around them is going to make them suffer for doing the way you did they don't understand their hell that's getting ready to come about them and i'm telling them the truth and they, they just want you to they're wanting to come in and give you a little pretend apology and i wouldn't take it because they're a shapeshifter they're shapeshifting you know, elephants, they got a great memory collective. And when one dies, the other elephants mourn their loss. This can last for days. See, uh, this can last for a long time. A mother elephant like a real human, you know, that, that you'll, you'll always mourn a child that's died, you know, or, or somebody that's really close to you. I mean, that's just natural, you know, and, uh, all I think it's saying is, um, spirit is going to shape shift around and they're going to be mourning. They're going to wish they hadn't have thought it was funny to make fun of you and your pain because they're going to see the greatest pain ever. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know who that's for collective 737 and, and it hurts, but it's for that one. It's for that one or that two that did it to you all collective that one. But the essence of one, this is activation. One is the seed, the beginning, when the life force is self-compelled to move out to explore and confront newness. It is original and individualistic because it is uninfluenced by previous experiences. It does not know that things cannot be done. It proceeds with complete faith to do the to to do this one is the pioneer facing the unknown with an innocent courage it draws upon its own creative will to solve any problems that arise see a problem is getting ready to arise for this person because they didn't understand that you're somebody who is a you're very individualistic and people in a spiritual community they understand you and and you're not influenced by others. And, and these people, they just, uh, you're like a pioneer facing the unknown at the moment because maybe you've got great memories of your past life and you teach this to others collective. You know, maybe you're like me, but all I know is these people that gossip about another person that don't know anything about that said person can ruin your reputation all because they let the devil in their heart yeah and they did they don't believe and you you don't don't believe everything that you hear and don't spread it see but that's all they can do is to gossip and spread it but look here it's jack ice that was doing that to you so he they might be losing somebody to breast cancer i'm sorry collective but you know someone needs to have a mammogram to get checked for breast cancer I mean, maybe this person was a try uh, that ruined your reputation. Maybe this person is has got observed and they got cancer, and uh, that's that that they're going to 
their family is going to be mourning them. That's what it said. They made fun of this person's mourning, and it's coming back to them. And and they could be a life path number one or a life path number five. But the essence of five, this is experience. The five needs freedom and independence so that it can indulge its senses and experiences of life. It has an insatiable curiosity through which it filters its encounters and ultimately makes choices that will influence its future. You're a communicator, impulsive and restless. You need freedom to move freely. So whoever this is, they act like a five-year-old, though, too. Did you know that? Uh, they, this person just wants, uh, this person has that restless energy. Uh, this person is trying to influence you to do bad again, maybe. You, so you better be listening to what I'm saying. And, and, uh, but one of y'all might be needing to move forward with and be independent on your own. It might be saying, observe that you need this independence to get away from us people. Because they might have been working, whoever this person was that was life and going on, they might have been working with somebody in your family or your partner. And as you wish that others would do to you, do so to them. Luke 6.31 These people thought it would be funny to live and make fun. Now, I tell you right now, whatever, and they thought it was funny that somebody would die, like about somebody that's had a lot of people die, and that they were suffering, and they never experienced something like that, like you did. Uh, it's going to happen to them. It's going to happen to them. And uh, that's why lithium on. See, this is watching the reflection of candlelight and precious stones. See? Someone that's precious to them. Is going to do them the same way they done you and me collectively. Ain't it funny how spirit and God shows it? Hang on a minute. <coughs> a, a very smart, brilliant genius with a bright smile. <laughs> Maybe you, maybe this person is sitting back and reflecting on their life now that they shouldn't have done this to you or said things about you because now they understand that you're a genius and they, they just want it to make you suffer. They just want it to make you suffer and ruin your reputations, but your spirit guided you. Your spirit guides guided you away from these people. And, and you learned to not let others drag you down for how they thought or felt about you. Well, that's okay. You can have your feelings and I'll have my feelings. People's going to understand that. Your feelings is your feelings. My feelings are my feelings. You know, and I got an opinion and I got a butthole. Just like everybody else in this planet. And you just got to learn to keep on going. And, and these people, that, they, they believe everything they hear and then they spread it. Well, all I know is they're, they're getting ready to have all that evil eyes spent right, sent right back to them. And that's the angels doing that for you. Okay. And whales are associated with compassion and solitude and knowledge of both life and death. Unbridled creativity. Also to whales, someone means to strike an opponent heavily and repeatedly in a fight. Oh, see, this person is going to have to be fighting for their life now. Whoever this is that was giving you evil eyes there, they're going to have to fight for their life now. And that's sad because we all know what that color means. You understand? I don't know who that is, collective, but somebody better be going and getting their tits checked and uh, stop being a, a jackass about it. And, oh, uh, they want to show some compassion and... <laughs> They know that you're very creative. But they want to strike you. They they just wanted to strike you when you was down. That's what it means. They only wanted to strike you because you was down. And uh, they they feel bad about it now, but we don't care. You got away from these people and your experience in life and all of its in, insatiable, but insatiable but things at the moment. Excuse me, I didn't say it right. But God is within her. She will not fall. You're not going to fall. You're not going to fail, collective, if you're on the good side. 
and you apologize for things, you don't have nothing to worry about. So looky there, you either got a spirit animal that's a jackass donkey, or a or a elephant, or a hedgehog. Oh, I love my collective. Do you love my little funny ones? Look, do you love my drawings? If you love my drawings, hit subscribe. If you love my drawings, hit subscribe. I love you guys, okay? All right, now. Let me see what else I can figure out. What do you say? And we have one of these for the collector, and we thank you very much. Let's feel it. Ooh, it give us, it give us connections, partnership, contract, commitment. Somebody's laughing about your partnership and your commitment, but they've never had to experience loss like me and my partner. So keep on laughing. It, it's getting ready to happen to you. Oh, sorry, but it is. For somebody that judged us, Collective 1616, yeah. Our spirit guides are going to help us. Uh, this is about kindness and nurturing your connections at the moment. And Kane, this is about life force energy, or Kanye. This is about life force is giving you the energy to be kind and nurturing at this moment. To this person that you're in a contract with or a partnership with, uh, or somebody's wanting to partner up with you, and Archangel Zad Kill came out. This is about self accept, self acceptance, compassion, forgiveness. This is about what we need to do, collective. So we need to be compassionate and forgive. Forgive what these people they hurt you. I forgive them. I forgive them, Spirit, and I thank you for. Trying to wipe that out of our energy. That's what me and my collective said. But we have a great memory about it all. The Archangel Raziel said, you, Use your wisdom because we're giving you some inspiration. Uh, or you're doing this for others You because you know how to read your Akashic records. So, life force might be telling you to Get out of this commitment and, and accept your your wisdom. And because it was written that you might have, or it was written that you needed to have compassion and forgive this person and stay committed. Uh, but that, this is about your safe space. You need to, in your safe space, talk to your partner, okay? And, and be kind and nurture and tell the truth. This is what somebody's wanting to do to you or you need to do. This is about life force energy is helping you to be an abundant success, collective prosperity. Okay. And these people that uh, made fun of you and laughed and all this hoobly hobbla, they want to tell you the truth now. They, that's what they're wanting to do. That's why that came out. The truth is you're going to be very prosperous, me and my collective is. Hang on. You wish they would just tell you the truth, and I think they're get, that's getting ready to come to you, collective. It might be getting ready to come to us. Hang on. What other archangels does that kill? Do we have some more archangels? I like them. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. Somebody uh, might have, this person might have paid someone to read your Akashic records and now they feel like a jackass because that hurt you in your spiritual community because they might have been a one to make your channel stop growing. I'll talk about that for me, Collective. I don't know if that happened to you all, but yeah, they're still in your wisdom. Oh, but you know, you're, this is about past life healing with this connection. You got to heal it and move on maybe. And be nurtured and tell the truth about all your cosmic knowledge. See, like me, I, you know, I, I speak about all the knowledge. And, and I keep I keep showing people things. I'm a genius. That's why it landed on that. Oh, thank you, Spirit. 
life force is helping you at the moment to become prosperous and i believe it i believe it oh and it's about sensitivity and strength your your guides gave you this this is an abundant supply of you know of strength on the inside of me and my collective we, we'll never we'll never run out you're tapping in within those forces at the moment what else on earth is that kill what else on earth is that kill what else hang on a minute Somebody's been observing. This is Angels of the Seven Chakras. This is about power, truth, connection. People's been observing the power of your truth and your connection and how you forgive them. Be patient. Be patient with this number five. If that's their life path number, you need to... Cause they, they have a lot of restless energy at the moment. They like to run freely, this person does, okay? What else about striking an opponent heavily or repeatedly in a fight? What's that? Spirit, what do you mean? Oh, this is about somebody, somebody wanting to strike their opponent heavily or repeatedly. Because they do, they they don't agree with your eternal love that you, the two of you share. There's Aphrodite. Ooh, look at her smexy titties. Maybe you're a full and voluptuous lady like that. And God is within you. You're not going to fall. You're not going to fall. And these people that wants to fight with you, they can't knock you off your fucking throne. They can't knock you off your throne. See, she's sitting on a down throne or something standing behind her. But they can't take your knowledge and your fucking wisdom. Be patient. God is with you. And this is about healing your heart at the moment. This is about opening up to love and acceptance and romance. Ooh, be romantic with the one you love. Okay? You're not going to fall. You're not going to fail. Be romantic, baby. That's what I'm telling you guys. Okay? That's what I'm telling you all now. Hang on, I don't want to do it. Let's do what you say. Spirit. What does my collective need to know about this connection, about this partnership, about that partnership? Oh, this this commitment, this contract, this is about your throne, your throne, bye bye. Or it could be saying like yes, is, hang on. It could be saying that you uh you need to work with the element air at the moment. You work with the elements of air and spirit to create new awareness on earth. You need to go outside in the wind tonight. It'll help you understand your partner a little bit more. Maybe they're a mystic and they want to be kind and nurture. That's what you're needed to do at the moment. You have a direct experience of spirit. That you transmit to others with divine love. See, spirit guides love you. You got such love inside of you, and and life force energy is bringing your throne. You're sitting on your throne of power, and and you're gaining proficiency with your persuasion. Oh yeah, yeah, and you gain ownership of a small keep. Life force is giving this to you. You need to accept it with compassion. And forgive yourself, seeker of truth. Oh, you are committed to find the truth and solving the great mysteries of life. So forgive yourself, seeker. And because you got a lot of wisdom in, uh, and know that somebody tried to veer into your Akashic records like a little phantom thief, stupid ass in the night. And what they didn't know is that phantom, it come to light that I'm telling the truth. See, yeah, so, uh, don't worry. They, 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 the, uh, 
they're being told the truth and it's okay because they know you're going to be you're going to have a lot of money and that's why spire come out uh you're gaining you're gaining up two skills that you didn't have you're gaining two skills in your safe space oh i love that spirit and what about hard tell the truth what about hard tell the truth what about hard tell the truth Oh, balance. See, you're balanced. You do tell the truth, and people realize this, and they're aware. You're balanced. And you also know that uh, somebody was trying to uh, make you suffer. They was trying to make you suffer a, a gut-riching alteration. They didn't want you to have no prosperity. They wanted this Don Juan... You, uh, they wanted you to be in tune in an extra-dimensional fear, and they was trying to keep you in prison. <laughs> they're, they're, they was trying to put you in prison, and, and God said, no, nah, Don John Juan, get the fuck out of here. That woman's balanced. That person is void. They're void of truth. They have none. Their connection their connection to, to, to truth and seeking more, they, they have no connection. They're void. Their soul is ripped plumb out of their eyes. Their soul is ripped plumb out of there. That's the truth. And patience, patience. Oh, you're a patience. You have a protector helping you. You're a spiritual guardian who looks out for others and keeps them safe, or that's what you do. You're protected. You're patient. And this past life healing, uh, maybe this person tried to kill you because it says kill any one character. It could have be a Scorpio, but a scorpion. Maybe you're trying to heal this past life connection and that person might have actually wanted to kill you or did try to kill you. One of the other. What about Merlin? Cause of knowledge under a mystic that's balanced and had to suffer. I love you, spirit. Oh, the key. Uh, you have the key to all this cause of knowledge because you're, you're brilliant. You're a genius. Oh, Uranus energy, me. Ha, ha, ha. Father time, Marilyn, Father time, see? Oh, you got the key, baby. You got the key. So, you got the key about a weapon. You got the key. It's inside your voice, and you freaking know it now. Oh, wow. You're a scribe. That's how you type into these forces. You write letters and you get messages from spirit like my little feather tree feathers feathers scribe oh go out you need to write down these sacred teachings and preserve them for the future like me see i got a lot of have a lot of strength and i do do that that's the key oh and and, and I, that's why gem came out somebody wants to give you some gold and gems because you you might have a greek lineage oh yeah or you might be linked to atlanta since some little whales came out oh gosh you was the most beautiful gem in both of those eras and you had a golden crown and you had such beautiful black hair oh wow oh god and you're not going to fall you're not going to fail because god is with you during all this healing your heart look at yellow yellow you're on fire, baby. You, you made a covenant with God. You got to accept this. Oh. Somebody might be wanting you to complete a trial. If you succeed that trial, you can grant nearly any request. But if you fail, you forfeit your soul. Did you hear that? You will not fail because it does say she will not fail. She will not fall. So don't worry, collective. I'm not, are you? No, 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 we're not. <coughs> when is this going to take place? Can we have a moon card for the collective? Moon card. Can we have a moon card for the collective? Moon card. Oh, they're trying to block your crown chakra. Secret of truth. Go outside in the air tonight. You're a mystic. You're a direct spirit. Uh, a direct channel to spirit look oh taurus so prosperity lies ahead remember it said prosperity didn't it yeah prosperity right down here see 
up this new moon in Taurus. Maybe this Taurus wants to come towards you. You got to hold your vision, seeker of truth. Hold your vision during this fixed moon. Don't let it go because somebody's trying to peek into your caustic records. Ah, seeker, you're going to get a phantom kill you into the night. Didn't you know that? Yeah. Oh, you're going to have a victory and success over that person. Prosperity still coming to you in your sacred space. And you're gaining more skills day by day. You're balanced. You're balanced. And that's a dawn one. And they haven't transformed that dawn one. They don't know how to transform like you do. They, they don't know how. They don't know how. But... They're, 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 they're patiently planning, but they're on the fence. Well, I'll tell you now, that connection is void. It's void. It's void. I, I wouldn't want it. No. Who would want a void one? No. No, no, no. Oh, and it comes to light that you got, you have a lot of spiritual strength because these people was coming from you at all sides. And I am a life path number fucking nine. And, and nine is a good number. It is. It's spiritually sound, and you can have the keys to a lot of knowledge. You're on your life's life. Did you understand that? That's what the fuck it means. That's what I am. I am that. And I do have a three and a six, too. Yeah. But see, the key is you're fertile at this moment. You're birthing, you're birthing your writings into life, and people love you. You're preserving all your knowledge, and you're tapping within, and you have an eternal love. This other person just wants to steal from you. They're just trying to hold you back. And you're like, no, I made a covenant with God. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. Oh, oh, oh. So I wanted you to be playing the waiting game. But you was protected by this person. Because you made a covenant with God. Because you made a covenant with God. And uh, the end of a tough cycle is approaching when the moon, full moon is in Capricorn here coming up. Okay. Yep. That's when God said you're going to... I'm, I'm accepting, I'm giving you something. You need to accept it. Accept that this person's soul got forfeited for them hurting your heart many years ago, and it could be a Capricorn, and they just forfeited their soul. And yeah, you better believe, believe in the impossible because it's getting ready to happen to that person, okay? It is collective now. It is now collective because that's what it said now. Let me see what I can get my cards to say. Spirit, spirit, can you give us a good message? Anyway, can you give up me and my collective? Uh